So we just got back on the ship. This is our last day in Norway. And um, they told us that at one of the shops in Norway that if you purchase anything in any of the shops that there was a sales tax added, like right here, some of the um, items we purchased in kind of like a regular store where they did add sales tax, that on the last day that of Norway, you can come back on to guest services and there'll be a stand set up and they will refund you the sales tax. So that's what we're doing right now. We're standing in this line back here and we're gonna go through that process and I will be back in a minute and I'll let you know how it works out, how they refunded us, if it's in our US dollars, if it's onboard credit or whatever the situation is. So stay tuned and I will be back. So I finished the whole process. I stood in line, I gave them my receipts and basically there's something on the receipt that you have to fill out. You do have to put your passport number on there and then your information like name, address and some contact info. So I did that, handed them receipts, and then you have to give them a credit card, any credit card. It doesn't have to be the one you use for your purchases, but any credit card, and they will. that's how they are going to refund your money to that credit card. So I did that, gave them all my information, my credit card. So now I just have to wait for my refund. I'm sure it'll be one of those things, you know, seven to ten days or whatever, some standard time frame. But um, anyways, it was kind of cool, cool process. It's glad to know that we could get our um, tax sales tax back. And um, so there you go. When you're, you're going to Norway, don't forget to um, turn in your receipts. The lift is going up. I'm on the elevator. <laughs> don't forget to turn in your receipts um, so you can get your sales tax back. All right, I just want to jump in here and kind of wrap things up because I kind of made the video pretty quickly on the ship. It was kind of new to me and I thought, hey, let me make a video and kind of show you guys. So the company that runs this kind of handles things is called Global Blue. You can go onto their website, read more about it. What There's other countries that are involved in this as well that you can receive sales tax back. We were in Norway, so this all has to do with Norway on, on this particular cruise. But make sure you do a few things. Like I said, um, read about it online on their website. They do have an app you can download. You may be able to receive some back on land travel as well. So read up on that, but make sure you save your receipts. One thing, you're not gonna get anything back if you don't have your receipts. So you need to save your receipts. Then also check with guest services to make sure they're gonna be on board and what time, because you need to make sure you're there because they do get off the ship before it sets sail and you don't wanna miss them because then you're out of luck. Now our cruise ended on July 4th and I received my refund for the sales tax back on July 11th. Um, it wasn't as much as I thought, but I wasn't really sure what I was gonna get back because the money is kind of showing that I purchased things in um, Norwegian Kronas versus US and, and so it was a little confusing needless to say. But anyways, um, I got like 24, I think dollars and some change back. So hey, every little bit helps. So I was happy with that. Um, so hope this was helpful and hopes it saved you a little money on your next cruise. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.